about what you'll bring to the Hornets? Oh, oh yeah, um, a winner. Uh, I'm a winner. Um, I'm always trying to win, do the best, do the best I can to win. Knock down open shots, any shot I can get, all the clutch shots. I want to try to make the best, and I'm just going to learn, learn from the best, and, and listen to the coach, and try to be the best, best player and, and best listener, and learner ever. So. Malik and Adam Lockley, NBA draft, got Ned. Uh, you were drafted by the Hornets. They have a great scorer with Kemba Walker. You're also a great scorer. How excited are you to play with someone that scores the ball as well as Kemba Walker next season? Uh, I'm just excited to play basketball. But being with him, too, I, I watched him a lot in college uh, when he was with UConn. And model, model, some of my stuff out of this game, uh, I got to step back from him. So. I was just thankful to be in this situation and hopefully it'll, it'll work out good. Were you, did you think the Knicks might take you at eight? And was it at all disappointing that you kind of fell to 11? Uh, I actually thought the Knicks would, would take me, but nothing's disappointing about getting drafted. <laughs> this has been my journey for, forever. And uh, nobody ever from, from my town ever been drafted and ever made it this far. So I'm just thankful to be here. Will you, you think this will give you a chip on your shoulder to the next level? For sure. <laughs> Why? I can't tell my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> Malik, Steve Kyler, basketball insiders right here in the middle. First of all, congratulations. Uh, so you go play next to Kemba, a team that desperately needs three-point shooting. Dwight Howard's already been on Twitter saying you're a great addition. How do you feel about kind of the environment you just found yourself in? Yeah, um, everybody's comfortable. Um, Dr um, Michael Jordan is the GOAT. <laughs> and he's with Charlotte now. I'm, I'm gonna learn a lot from him. And um, everybody, like I said, everybody's comfortable. Kim was comfortable because he, he's with my agency. Same. Um, I talked to him before, and um, everybody's comfortable, just like me. So I'm just ready to get to work. Congratulations. Thank you. I'm back here. Um, congratulations. First off, is there an NBA player that you try to model your game off of right now? When I was younger, I watched a lot of Russell Westbrook, but I, I really don't try to model my game out of anybody right now. Thank you. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Hi, Henry Moore, as I guess. As you mentioned, Michael Jordan is there. How exciting is it for you to be able to learn from the greatest player of all time who also plays your position? And how much do you think that will add to your game? I still can't believe it. <laughs> right now, I still can't believe it. But uh, maybe, maybe tomorrow I'll believe it. Um, but I think he'll, he'll, he'll teach me a lot, and I'll, I'll take it. You can make yourself each year, each year. I'm gonna try to learn a lot, as much as I can from him. So, hey, Billy, congratulations, bro. Appreciate it, bro. Yeah. Um, do you have any goals or expectations for yourself in your rookie season? Um, like I said, uh, learn, learn a lot. But I'm trying to be rookie of the year yeah. um, and get to, get to the rookie rookie game and All Star weekend. So, uh, there's a lot of goals I'm gonna set. Malik, your owner is still pretty competitive. Do you think he's going to challenge you to a one-on-one -on -one game when you get down there? And if so, are you going to do the political thing, or are you going to try to be him? Who's going to challenge me? I think the team owner has been known to still like to get on the court. And, uh, I'm to be. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> fair enough. Well, you said you're from a small town. Which town is that? Uh, Lepanto, Arkansas. Uh, Northeast, Northeast of Arkansas. It's close to Memphis. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, like 30 minutes from Memphis. So it's not far from Little Rock also. So. Uh, yeah, it's like an hour and a half, two hours from Little Rock. Yeah, have you ever met Bill Clinton, who is very active around <laughs> here, or, uh, or <laughs> Governor Huckabee? I was just curious. I actually have. Oh. Okay. Uh, yeah. The woods. Thanks, Maurice. You're all set.